This is multi-pump test rig which consists of four types of pump used by students to conduct experiments on pump by collecting data. The four types of pumps are centrifugal pump, gear pump, axial pump, and turbine pump. Today, we are going to do an experiment using turbine pump. This is a turbine pump. To operate the pump, we need to connect it with a dynamometer motor. Step 1. Open the dynamometer clamp knob. Step 2. Pull the motor to the turbine pump. Step 3. Connect the tooth drive belt between the dynamometer motor pulley and the turbine pump. Step 4. Push the dynamometer motor to the center. Straighten the belt and lock the dynamometer clamp knob. Step 5. Close the safety door. Step 6. Open the turbine valve, continue with flow control valve and vacuum turbine valve. Step 7. Fix the V-notch wheel using bolt and tighten it. Step 8. Close the dump valve by pressing the ball valve to avoid the water from flowing back to the main tank. Step 9. Switch on the main switch to activate the machine. Switch on the speed control switch and set the speed according to the figure on the lap sheet. Step 10. Set the torque balance by adjusting the weight gauge. Water from the tank is sucked by the turbine pump with the force of the motor and flow through flow control valve which ignite the pressure reading on the gauge. The water flow to the volumetric tank through the V-notch attached. Step 11. Take the elapsed time starting from level 0 to level 10 liters by using a stopwatch. Fill the elapsed time reading and pressure reading on the lab sheet provided. Repeat step 9 to 11 for the next 5 different motor speed reading. Refer the lab sheet provided of speed motor, speed control, vacuum turbine valve, control valve, turbine valve, and main switch. Hope the students will understand the function and the efficiency of the turbine pump. Thank you.